Hello everyone, in this tutorial I am going to calculate the integral of a function and uh, I am going to use threads and this is uh, so that we are going to uh, choose an interval and then we are going to divide this interval and, uh, in a few uh, sub-intervals and each sub-interval has a thread and each thread is going to calculate the integral in those sub-interval. For this, I am going to start a, a new project, a console application, and I am going to define a uh, few uh, class variables like a static object lock, new object, and uh, semaphore uh, for semaphore 55 and double sum and uh, string s0 and the uh, semaphore uh, given us that opportunity to decide how many uh, how many uh, threads can run at the same moment with maximum how many seconds with maximum in maximum how many seconds and the lock object is going to uh, uh, to watch over that uh, threads cannot uh, crash uh, on each other and uh, for uh, in the main I am going to use a while loop and we are going to put sum as zero uh, each time we want to uh, restart the program again and we are going to have a try catch and in try we are going to ask uh, the item of threads you decide how many threads you need it and we are going to put it uh, read inside the, the thread counts and it is integer and then we are going to ask the interval in an interval please enter an interval decimals with comma and uh, differ with the space uh, for min and max and then uh, we are going to uh, uh, read that uh, interval in the range and we are going to split by spaces and we are going to directly select uh, uh, maximum and minimum in uh, uh, x uh, variable and then uh, in uh, we, uh, we are going to have a step size which is the range of max mi minus range of mean divided by uh, item of uh, threads and then we are going to uh, we are going to ask after the number of sub intervals and we are going to read inside the sub count and uh, uh, it's going to uh, it's integer and we are going to use a variable uh, thread recess as enum enumerable uh, variable of, of range and we are going to have a start as zero and count with thread count and we are going to uh, have a select each x and be the build the arguments for the thread to start and we are going to use the integral calc args it is a, a method we have uh, defined it uh, below and we are going to use the a step size or a step uh, each uh, we are going to uh, each sub intervals has uh, 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 x variable 
and we are going to make such a uh, interval and then we are going to um, we are going to call to the thread and this is the parameter size thread start and we are going to call the integral calc method and uh, we are going to use a start thread args which is here and we are going to return that uh, thread args the uh, reset even and we are going to put all those uh, uh, stuff in an array and uh, for uh, and we are going to use a loop to weight handle weight all and we are going to uh, uh, we are going to wait all the until all the trades are done and the maximum limit is 64 for us and then we are going to put the result the integral of sinus sine x in interval that one is sum and uh, and in exception catch exception we are going to change the color as the warning and we are going to uh, use the uh, error message and uh, we use reset color that uh, the whole uh, the whole uh, screen or uh, console is not red only uh, this message is red and then we are going to put a, tr a read key through that we press that we are sure that all the threads are done run and after that we are going to ask the, if you want continue and we are going to read in the S0 which is aimed to the this while loop to this while loop and as you know sum is a global variable now we are going down and we are going to define our class integral cal uh, calculating args and we are going to use manual reset even reset even get uh, equals to new manual reset even pulse and then we are going to have a, a few uh, uh, property start and sub intervals sub interval length sub interval points and uh, the result and in uh, method integral uh, or in uh, constructor integral calc args we have three parameter start end and sub intervals and we are going to use the <coughs> start is mean value of start and end end is max value between start and end and sub interval is uh, max between one and sub, sub intervals and sub interval length is uh, uh, end minus start divided by uh, double of sub intervals and the sub interval points is the range between um, this one range from zero until sub interval and each x is start plus double x multiple by sub interval length and the result is in the array and then we are going to have a, a method integral calc 
and we are going to make a object of integral calc uh, args and if object is not null then we are going to uh, use the weight semaphore and we are going to uh, use a double uh, variable sum equals zero and then we are going to use a for loop and we are going to use sum plus equals double mat sign of args of sub interval points of i multiple by args args of sub interval length and then we are going to write the integral in sub interval is the sum in sub interval and it is which thread is it and it is sum and uh, we are going to use lock to be sure that uh, no other thread updating to the one thread and we are going to make the global sum plus equal to sum and in uh, catch expression uh, exception we are going to uh, give an uh, error message in red and uh, finally uh, we are going to set the arcs and it is uh, all the signals uh, are done and we are going to release the semaphore okay now we are run running our program enter the item of thread I use 100 and please enter an interval I am going to use 3 3 point 14 which is pi and please enter number of sub enter of uh, sub intervals mm, 10 and then we have all those threads 100 threads all those 100 threads has uh, run it and then uh, we are uh, we have the integral each each sub intervals has defined and you can see in each sub intervals the integral and sum of all those things are the sum which is almost two which is correct and we are pressing and we are going to use yes this time I take uh, 10 threads and uh, 0 3.14 and then I am going to use uh, 20 and it is these things and the integral is almost 2 then you know how it is works and it was all in this tutorial thank you for watching see you on next tutorial